Oh, hi there, Team Ozone. I got a Wii U. You know, I haven't even played a game on it. I just got it. Hey, look, elite four member blind guy, I assume. In Sweden, we have very good understanding of what makes a good fight scene, especially for cops. These flying Pokemon are good at that, too. Alright, um, cool. Flying type guy in the Elite Four. Actually, I don't think I've ever seen that. And he's also a cop. Wonderful. Again, I like the old Elite Four much better. It's like, I was a Phoebe fan since day one. She had ghosts and she could talk to them, and I'm just like, I love that. Somebody who not, looks not at their Pokemon as things to use or, you know, pets, but as, you know, you talk to them, equals. They're like, you, you bro fist them. And you guys play rock, paper, scissors to decide who gets the last candy corn piece? I don't really know about that. Alright, so you've got flying type Pokemon. I'm going to skip through the battle since it's... Actually, I can't skip through because it's the full battle, so I probably... Do I have any ice type attacks is what I'm wondering. Do I have any... Oh, right, right. He's got flying types, but... Yeah, hit will probably do a crap out of damage. Let's see. Sleep powder. Oh, god damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. That is not helpful at all. It's got fucking leftovers. This is because I'm... Freaking tank or something stupid like that. Spam spark, spam spark! Oh god, I'm gonna be asleep for quite a long while. Yeah, because back in this generation, you could sleep for about a solid five to seven turns without anything really happening. It's just that great of a generation. No, I'm, I don't mean anything bad against the generation, I'm just saying. Sleep wasn't nerfed back then. What the frig? Oh, it's a flying fighting type attack. Perokamon. Perokamon. Peroki mans. Kinda like karaoke and Pokemon, but combined. Speed boost, flying, fighting, and high attack stat. Again, that seems totally fair and based. Oh, god damn it. Dragon breath. Good. Fly. I, oh my gosh. I'll speed into the battle just because I really don't like this Pokemon. Use Ice Punch. Why wait a minute? Why did you not use Ice Punch sooner? I'm going for dive. Full restore. Artificial difficulty. Gotta love that shit. No, seriously, I'm never going to drop the artificial difficulty claim. Like, I will pick on that and pick on it till it is no more. See, that's two full restore. Actually, if they're limited to two, I probably won't mind if it's just two. And to be fair, I'm not doing much damage at the moment. So it has two elemental punches, which is kind of weird, because elemental punches are special attacks in this generation, so... Eh. But, them being special attacks aside, they still hurt like a bitch if they hurt. Please tell me he's not going to just survive with one HP every time, and then he's going to use that stupid-ass heal attack. Er, I'm sorry, not heal attack. It's gotten to the point where that full restore just seems like an attack that they have in their slot. It's like a reserve weapon. I don't care what your final Pokemon is, I'm gonna explode right here. Boom, boom. Yeah. Alright, Keg, you're up to bat. I know you have the type disadvantage, but that's okay. Poison powder for the win. Poison powder, poison powder, poison powder. There we go. See, this thing's gonna try and take me out. Take me out, eh? Huh? No. You're water, flan type. I got this. And maybe it won't... Wait... Isn't the point of tank like stalling me out after you've poisoned me? I'm just saying, I don't know these things, I'm just... It goes for fly, not very effective as always. I mean, it is super effective, but it's not gonna do a lot of damage, because Pelipper actually... When Wingle evolves into Pelipper, it loses a crap ton of its offensive power and gets some tanky defensive power, which I think is stupid. It should have two evolutions, one Wingle with like, Wing King or some crap like that, it's all majestic as all hell, it's a C pelican but like all sharp and pointy and really quick and water flying and it has a high attack stat crappy everything else I would totally dig that and then there would be this other thing which is like actually we already have Pelipper which is the defensive one that would be awesome how the hell is Felicia or whatever the hell her name is still part of the Elite Four why am I so hurt damn it should have brought more hyper potions son is what you're thinking I'm like you know what, I'm not going to have any Pokemon faint after this now. Except for Glitchy, who's going to freaking boom, kaboom everything. Gosh. Glitchy, just booming everywhere. I know Pokemon don't like you if you do make them faint a lot, but at the same time, this game is uh, worth it. I'm Glacia. Oh, it's not Felicia. Crap. I came here from far away, but I ended up staying. I was too strong for the zombies to get. Also, you probably just freeze them and your blood's probably frozen too. I don't know. I always assumed you were the hardest person in the Elite Four of this generation because uh, that's kind of how it's always been. Her team was always just tough, what with the weather effect of hail pounding the hell out of my Pokemon on the sides. It's like, hey, we're going to fight you, and also you're going to take 1 16th of your HP every turn. I'm like, what? Rock Smash, probably not. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's like a three shot KO, meaning. 
Artificial difficulty incoming in one. Yeah, there we go. This will take a while unless I can lower that defense, which I did. Next off is Wall God damn it. Discharge. Not enough. Okay, plan B. Hyper beam! I missed. I don't know how I missed a fucking giant ass hyper beam, but apparently I did. Now I can't move for the next turn. I'm gonna swap out because I'm not supposed to. Fudge! I was like, I'm not supposed to have anybody faint. Okay, glitchy. Boom! Seriously, if you have anything that is like gonna get rid of the wall rains, do it ASAP. Wall rain. Evil! Cloyster. That's, that's new. Thunder wave it. Surf. Okay, there. I got nothing much to worry about. Just spark the hell out of it. Boom. Uh, Weavile? I don't know why you got a Weavile. It's not exactly the greatest thing. To okay, whatever. Ah, oh, crap. I'm not gonna have enough revives at this rate. Uh. Cut. Why did that not KO with my 160 attack stat? Oh, look. More artificial difficulty. Love that shit. Alrighty. More artificial difficulty in 3 2. Not now, apparently. Huh. I'm actually positively survived. Uh, Articuno? Really? Wait a minute. I've seen an Articuno before, haven't I? Wait a minute. I have revived. Oh, I'm out of healing items, aren't I? Shit. Articuno is rather tanky on all aspects, so might as well just go for beat up. Maybe that'll. Damn it. Damn it. Okay, crap. Uh. Shit. Okay. How many revives do I have? I got four, and if I faint right here, that's okay. Okay, that's okay. I'm gonna full restore. I swear to God, if I lose to these guys because I didn't have enough revives, that's, that's gonna suck. Uh, I'm gonna go for Shadow Ball. It's it's my strongest physical attack right now, I guess. Oh, crud. Alright, I'm definitely faster with Guy Fury, so I need to one sh Oh, yeah, Fire Blast. Derp! Damn it! Yes! Fire Blast! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that was so stupid. <laughs> my 85 power attack hits, but hers doesn't. Oh, this is so dumb. I don't know who Indigo is, but hold up. I gotta heal my team. Damn it. I I took just about, like, the right amount of casualties, but still, if I want to face off against whatever champion they have planned, it's gonna be a little difficult. Especially since I only have no healing items. I got a water bottle? Heals a burn. That's dumb, 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 dumb. Maybe I have some citrus berries. I do recall. Yes, eight of them. Perfect. They also taste like shit, but that's not my problem. Citrus berries. Who's gonna need them most? Probably not glitchy. I can just self destruct or explode. Same thing, really, though. There's not much of a difference. Self destruct is just a little less weak. Uh, a little more weak. And. Giraga, we need in case they have any sort of fire type attacks. Wait a minute. I have soft boiled. Oh wait, crap, I just forgot about that, didn't I? Alright, I'm gonna save real quickly. Save. Saving again. And we'll go on and fight what's uh, the next member. Have we taken out three members in one video? If we have, that's great. Da -da 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 Battle me! I'm Indigo, the Thunder King, with the power of the sky, I'll strike you down. If he's got dragons and a Rayquaza, I'm gonna shit myself. Alright, oh, what the fuck? I was gonna say alright, but the dude's got no legs, it's just electricity. Oh, it's a team of electric type Pokemon. Well, shit. Luxray is actually very powerful in this game, and thus I'm going to switch on over to Keg. Discharge, not very effective. I'm gonna go for Sleep Powder, it goes for Crunch, god damn it. I don't actually care, I got my Moonlight. Pedal Dance, okay, oh, it. In three turns. Four turns. Damn it, damn it. Sleep out again. Sleep better. Moonlight. Again. This could be a lot of artificial difficulty. Or I could just get my butt kicked. Yay, crit on both sides. Amphros is up next. Gonna go for. Shit, 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 shit. Yeah, why does Amphros know that? Whatever. Go, glitchy. Uh, explode. Boom. Bam. Done. Why am I speeding through these battles? Because again, I don't really like them and it seems rather pointless. But Ice Punch is super effective against Zapdos. Zapdos goes for agility, not that effective, because obviously, why does it need speed over me? I'm already slow as all shit. And Citrus Ray activates, gonna go for Ice Punch, Thunderbolt probably KO'd me, then I'm gonna go over to. Nobody on my team is faster than things, so I'm gonna go for Dragon Breath. Not effective because it uses Detect. Why would you. I don't care. 
Now they're detect. Apparently detect works twice in a row. Pecks at me. It's paralyzed. Now that I'm fascinated, you need to full restore. I'm going to go for fire blast because I need some high damage right now. I missed. God damn it. There's no power for that. I got to fly. It's not very effective because it's a flicking electric type. And this goes on for a while. I don't really have healing items. This is not good. Uh, drill pack. I think I'm about to lose this. I'm going to have to battle all the way through here once again. I guess I'll go for Spark, maybe it's super effective. Nope, try attack, full restore. Gee, I wish I had all those full restore. Why is it super effective when it's not even super effective? Alright, I'm fucked. I know this, so I'm gonna go fry Bream. Ah, uh, yeah, I will see you guys in a few. Gotta go fight these guys, and by that I mean I gotta go buy Hyper Potions because I need as many as they do. Damn it. I'm gonna. And we're back. I brought Naruko because I was like, hey man, why do I keep getting my butt kicked by this one dude? And it's like, Naruko's not here. Okay. I'm afraid I'm not the last. Now you'll be the, the champion which people out of the door. Obviously, that's kind of how the game goes. Alright, so before anything, I'm just gonna heal everybody up, but that was pretty easy. I mean, Naruko basically stomps everybody. Somehow. Oh uh, crap, I need snake oil. I don't know why snake oil, but whatever. We're gonna face the champions. Oh, wait. Champions. I mean, the champion. Unless there's two of them. There could be two of them. The game does surprise in some senses. Please, tell me who the... Hmm. Feng Li. I don't know who the hell this is. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, you want to fight me? That can be arranged. Shall we then? Who the hell is Feng Li? Is he like... Is this some sort of avatar thing? No, it's Palmer. Hajika King Feng Li. Would like to battle. Okie dokie, he's got him on top. Um, it lowers my attack, but that's not a big deal since I'm a special attacker, so I'm gonna go with Will O Wisp and, you know, crap on its attack stat. See, a Pokemon that has burned, has been burnt, its attack goes cut in half, and that way it's not that big of a threat to you. Scary Face is a little big more, uh, bigger of a threat, because it does make me slower, but. I mean, it's a him on top. It's not exactly the fastest thing in the world. So I'm gonna go with. Oh, there it is. Okay, that's, well, okay, whatever. He's burnt, so his attack is, you know, minuscule. So I'm gonna go with Fire Pump. Probably, maybe, sort of, kind of getting it low or not at all. I mean, the burn damage helps. Oh, he with. What? This boss is Smock. Smock? Rock Lobster! That being a Pokemon just makes me unhappy. I'm gonna switch out, because obviously this is a water type, so we're gonna go over to Keg, put that thing to sleep, I hope. Unless it's got some sort of BS ability, so... Uses Rock Slide! It's not even that bad, it's a rock type attack. Oh, but that would be very... Why does that thing hit so hard? And... Meaty Ball restores HP as damage done. Yeah, yeah, you're going straight to sleep, buddy. You're slow, but you got God's, like, freaking attack stat. I need it. KO'd right now, because uh, I'm going to be in trouble if it let this thing survive. It did a lot of damage with a neutrally effective attack. If that hit uh, Naruko, she'd be dead. Alright, so hopefully, what? What? Crap. How the hell is that thing not weak to grass? I mean, I thought it was a water type. And now it restores like nearly all of its HP, because hey, why not give the thing that's got a weird type? Oh shit, I'm locked in a pedal dance or not. Yep, so I'm fucked. Unless I switch, I mean, I can't even switch now because of the critical hit. Of course, that does damage. Now he's gonna kill me. Well, slide, and I don't have reviving items. I only have a few hyper potions. God damn it. 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 Okay. Maybe it's weak to electric tap attacks. I mean. And then again. Yeah, it's gotta be weak to electric tap attacks because if it was weak to anything, like, I don't know. If grass was effective, it would be ground- what? It's an electric water type. And it knows Earthquake. Yeah, I call bullshit. That's not even funny. Not- I'm not laughing. I'm not laughing at the, uh, Rock Lobster. Beating the crap out of a Pokemon right now. Alright. Uh, do I have a ground type attack? I don't think I do. I have Eruption. It's- It's an electric water type. Electric water toy. 
I need to either brute force kick its ass, which is gonna be hard because it's got like stupidly high attack. All right, glitchy. You brute. Wait, what? It's low on HP. Okay, I got this. It is electric water, so maybe I can just eruption blast it. I am faster than it, and this will do a lot of damage. What with my HP being in maximum. So please, guys, let this just KO and let it happen. Let it happen. Uh, oh shit! That did one damage. Wow! Wonderful. All right. Um, plan B. Uh, I'm just gonna skip that and boom! There you go. Totally worth it. All right, Narco, you gotta take out like three of his Pokemon now. Radio Orange. If this thing is not weak to fire type attacks, I'm done. I will legit just stop playing the game right here. It's not very effective. Oh! Alright, but for like real, why is like a little lemony thing that's totally like a fruit or something not weak to grass? That should totally be a thing. Why is it not? It's a fruit, it's grass. Hmm, <sighs> going to have to place. Okay, uh, yeah, next game. I'm legit doing a different game. I'm not playing this shit. This is so dumb. This is like, it does not make sense. I mean, it, it, like by Pokemon Logic. And yes, I know this is going on on a limb because Pokemon Logic is like very loose. It doesn't make much sense, but still, that's fruit. If you set a fruit on fire in the Pokeverse, there's even a move for destroying fruits. It's called Incinerate. No, this game has no rewarding, no satisfaction. It's just, it's like, I guess it's like funny if you're very childish or just. Whatever, but like with Pokemon normally, it's like you don't have to be childish to get into it. You can just get into it and feel and stuff, and it's nice. But here, it's like, oh, the childish jokes and other things. There, there's, has there ever been a heartfelt moment? No, it's just a bunch of angst, emo stuff, and bad jokes. Granted, a lot of that is my own commentary sometimes in videos of Pokemon, but there's no positive to balance it out. This game is nothing but negativity. It. Really? It, ah, I guess the orange was the last straw. Eh, that's weird.